the R7-1700, a CPU that honestly blew my expectations out of the water. Coming from an i5-4690K, I didn't even realize what I was missing out on. Blazing fast speeds with no hindrances or hurdles due to the near ludicrous core count, dank fucking LED lights, and the opportunity to place the fan on sideways like a goddamn mongoloid. Jokes aside, I'm a dude that has openly shat on AMD in the past. I hated my 8120 processor and I'm not a big fan of my 390 because I hate AMD. But this is different. First and foremost, I fucked up the gaming benchmark. I'm new to this stuff. I wish I had recorded 1% lows and 0.1% lows, but I messed up and the benchmark is pretty much useless. You can take these numbers however you want. I wish I had tested more CPU intensive games because I went from 30 FPS on a 390 in the division to 90 plus and no more stuttering, and everything is copacetic. <laughs> what I can show you is the absolutely ridiculous difference in rendering speeds. Take a look at this. So what takes the 4690K overclocked to 4.3 gigahertz, by the way, 40 minutes is only 20 minutes on the stock 1700. My god. And unlike the 4690K, you don't have to walk away from your computer while something is rendering because the 1700 only hit like 60% usage during the render. And yes, comparing these two isn't exactly fair because it's DDR3 RAM versus DDR4 and yada yada whatever. I'm sure there are others out there with their 4690Ks eyeing this processor needing just a bit more of a push before they're sent over to Team Red and I'm just here to give them that push. A lot of people say the jump isn't worth it if all you do is game, but I disagree. I feel like the CPU opens doors and lets you do whatever it is you want to do. I guess we call that quality of life. The CPU has a lot of that. So who am I saying should get the CPU? Anyone that feels their CPU is lacking. Stuttering in games, unable to stream or record gameplay, slow rendering times, high temps, no LEDs, I don't know. Just fucking buy it, punk. Or maybe the 1600, bitch. They're probably both really good.